Hey there, everyone. Uh, this is Ravkow. New episode of the Bowling Alley. You might be wondering why I'm playing Resnor here. Well, as the great Gonzalez pointed out in my thread. Whoops. Ah, uh, oh, god damn it. Well, um, you'll see soon. We've hit the one million point mark. And I figured that as a celebration, we'd watch it scroll up. Oh, I just came. It's, oh man. Oh, the, eh, you just never, it all, oh man, you always hit that one million. It just feels so freaking right. Well, now that that's out of the way, let's start my chronometer and start proper. Mar so we're playing Mario X World 2nd Edition Returns. Apparently, he'll, he'll place 3, so technically not done with level 4, I guess. Because as you can see, there's a lot of mushrooms here, and that never happened. That was a, a demo. It was to showcase what happens if. If you're starting Hilltop Zone 2 and and forget, because I, I had forgotten for a while there. As you can see here, the um, the gimmick of the world is you need to jump and go to the right. And it takes you always one to uh, enhance the gameplay experience by, by making succinct references to the joys of horticulture. Right, guy? Glad you agree. Wow, there's always the... Already the end of world there? I, I hope not. Whoa! <laughs> okay, blind jumps are always fun! It's what I call... Awesome level design! Hey, whoa! Oh. There was a blog there. Do, uh, oh, uh, message to all ROM ha hacky sack persons. Try to avoid, uh, restrain yourself from... For the love of God. From, uh, depending on invisible blocks, I mean, not that I have anything against them myself, but they're, it's kind of a tired system there, you see? I mean, it's like these bouncing blocks. It, it, it's all nice and good, but they don't really bounce all that well, because look, I can barely dodge this Pokeball, which hurts, apparently. Because, uh, I mean, Pokemon is nothing but the o an ode to animal cruelty. And it really takes an independent ROM hack that's totally unrelated to really showcase the reality of the um, garage industry. It, it's a shame that our community has fallen to that. Whereas in the past it would just make some sort of fairy tales about about fairies living inside the mutual of Maha Maha, or however you pronounce that. I'm not too sure myself, to be honest. It's, wow, I can just do this. I'm killing you with pool and bank shots and plants, and I can go here. Will I be, no, uh, I thought it was like a cannon shot. Well, maybe, maybe it's going to be a cannon shot, but I need to return to the can part, and for some reason it's, it's a complicated series of jump here. There's a last dragon coin that's going to give me a life. Remember that, Guar 3K1, just in case you forgot. Dragon coins, when you get them all, you get a free life. That's how the cookie crumbles. Uh, oh! Well, that wasn't nice at all. Now, oh, oh, brrr! <laughs> I have reduced myself to sound effects. For love of God, oh. I cannot outrace a bullet. <laughs> what kind of folly is that? I mean, come on. Wow, that's it? Hey, hey guys, it's a good thing I've installed that 5 minute rules or else that would have been uh, one video. Wow, that level had like absolutely nothing. Like, nothing at all to, to differentiate itself from anything. So, so we're gonna go into a water place. Water place. It's not, a, oh, well I thought it was gonna be a black and white level, but... Nope. It's not even an underwater level, it's a water top level with missile mic. Uh, the other day I was looking at my old videos and it appears that I was not the one to dub these Missile Mike originally. It was actually, uh, I always forget your name. It's something, something would. Whoops, I was kind of acting rather slowly there. <sighs> Slowness will get you killed in these troubled time and waters and warm wood plants. Wormwood is more or less a reference to many things, such as enemies literally coming out of the walls. Um, whoa, <laughs> watch out there, uh, 
missile dude, that is not a safe pre-requirement. When you're making your pre-requirements for whatever reason, I don't know, maybe you're a safety technician, that's plausible. I mean, I don't know every secret of your life, as far as I know. Maybe you're actually a paratrooper, and not that I have anything against those, but, you know, para paratroopers are... are, are, are our paratroopers. I'm, I'd rather not go forward more. I know that usually it's best to always go forward, but sometimes it's, it's, it's uncomfortable for everyone involved. I mean, you need to understand that not everyone has the same standards for everything. Uh, well, well, I can barely see the, the trail. I bet you guys can't even see them, period. They're like these little white things. I mean, not that I have anything against little white things, and quite the contrary, I'm not a reverse racist or anything, but, I mean, I need to take a bath like everyone else. What? <laughs> I don't know, it, sometimes it's best to accept reality for what it is and not for what it could be. I'm glad you guys understand, but I need to go on forward, and uh, I guess that's it for this Mario X World Deluxe segment. You know what, guys, I'm kind of happy that I'm not just playing this game on its own anymore, because doesn't really have all that much to offer sometimes. Oh well, uh, this is Al Cow playing Mario X World Second Edition Returns. Join me next uh, time when we go into the fourth fortress. But that's not coming next. The next vid we're returning to Super Super Mario World Plus. So don't do anything with that skipping rope. It is not time to go outside yet. Because God, you're playing with a skipping rope. What are you, a five-year-old girl? Man, well, I guess it's possible.